Hey, thanks for that on Facebook. I just wanted to start to get to know people before September. Excited for Northwestern next year? By the way, sorry if there's some weird letters. I'm in Copenhagen right now, and the keyboard isn't exactly the same as the US. And some things probably won't show up right. What dorms did you sign up for? I put Allison as my first choice. Hey, Copenhagen. That's pretty sweet. I'm still confused about housing. Thinking to put Bob first, but also Allison. I'm really excited for next year. We start so late though. It's actually good. What are you doing in Copenhagen? Hey, what seminar did you end up with? I got forensic chem. I'm so excited. Except it involves the most writing possible, like 30 to 40 pages. What about you? Forensic chem? Why the heck would you choose that? What a nerd. Huh, well, good luck with that. The amount of writing was definitely a big factor in which seminar I chose. Hey, where are you staying? I'm in McCulloch. Ah, Rucha, you're so far away. I'm in Willard. It's okay, I'm sure we'll hang out. Um. Chicago is waiting for you to get the hell out of Vero. No offense to Vero, I've never been. Hey, so I got my wisdom teeth out today. My jaw is still completely numb and I can't talk, but I can write. And yes, I have chub cheeks. I give you permission to make fun of me all you want. What are you up to tonight? Hey, chubby cheeks. Haha, ha, okay. It'll stop soon enough. Maybe. Wink face. Are you pumped? Like 12 more hours. You're coming to Millennium on Wednesday? Awesome. See you then. Bon voyage. <laughs> You know, from Florida. How are you doing? Oh, hey Nihar. Why is he calling me? How's Chicago? I'm actually not there yet. I'm just about to head to the airport and thought I'd call to say hey. So what's your plan? Just hanging out. I'm excited to meet you and everyone else. Vera's so boring now that all my friends are gone. Oh, yeah, definitely. Hey Rucha, I actually have to run. But see you soon. Okay, bye. Wow, she's actually a really cool girl. Hey, sorry I had to hang up on you. I'll probably call you tomorrow or something, I don't know. Yeah, Devon was pretty cool. We ended up going to the grocery store and stocking up on Indian food. I gotta have my Parley G, L-O-L. -L. We went to Woodlands and ate South Indian for dinner and then went to a sweet market for dessert, yum. I'll be moving in pretty early because my parents have a 6 p.m. flight on Tuesday. We'll probably show up around 9-ish. We should definitely meet up. How's the packing going? Rich already made plans to meet up with some new Northwestern friends in Millennium Park before school officially started. I had just flown up from Florida to move in, so she invited me to join. It was kind of intimidating meeting all these new people. But with Rucha, I was comfortable from the start. She was just so easy to talk to. It was hard to focus on meeting new people when I just wanted to get to know her better. I was worried that I was paying too much attention to her and it might come off as kind of... Creepy. I was not used to getting this much attention from a guy and I usually took it to mean either they were interested in me or a weirdo. I actually asked my friends on the way to Millennium Park to protect me from him because I was so afraid of meeting him. We went to 
to an Asian noodle place near campus. I remember having a lot of fun afterwards at the formal with our friends, but there was something even more special when it was just the two of us at Joy East. I totally think it was a Thai iced tea. So Nihar will never admit it, but he definitely took the same math class as me just to be close to me. I guess somehow he thought tutoring me in chemistry and math would make us better together. Hey, it worked. We've been through a lot of life's moments together over the past few years. Including different jobs. Living in different countries at months at a time. Rucha going to medical school and starting residency. And Nihar going back to school. We've been all across the world, including road trips, and made some wonderful friends along the way. And we're firm believers that it is our family and friends who have helped shape the foundation of our relationship. And we are so thankful for all the love and support you have all shown us. We're thrilled to share this special occasion with you and start our future as husband and wife. So, I had my computer open and this girl goes, Oh, is that your boyfriend? He's cute. Thought you'd like to know.